The ongoing drama involving Prince Harry and Meghan Markle is taking new turns, and now it has reached the gates of Althorpe, the Spencer family's ancestral home. Recent reports indicate that Louis Spencer, Viscount Althorpe, has made it clear that his cousin Prince Harry is not welcome to stay at Althorpe, despite Harry's apparent attempts to connect with the Spencer side of the family. As tensions escalate between Harry and the British royal family, it seems he is looking for solace with his maternal relatives, but it won't be easy. Harry recently visited Althorpe while in the UK for his uncle Lord Robert Fellow's memorial service, who was married to Lady Jane Spencer, Princess Diana's older sister. Initially, this visit seemed like a family affair, but insiders suggest that Harry may be trying to get too comfortable at the Spencer estate. Is he merely visiting, or is he laying the groundwork to make Althorpe a second home, especially after he and Meghan were asked to leave Frogmore Cottage earlier this year? Reports from various podcasts speculate that he might have found a refuge at Althorpe, away from the scrutiny of the British monarchy, given its deep personal significance for him as Princess Diana's childhood home and burial site, a sanctuary far removed from royal pressures. However, it appears that Viscount Althorpe is not eager to have his cousins settle there permanently. Louis Spencer, as the heir to Althorpe, understands the importance of his family's estate and seems intent on protecting it. Allowing Harry and Meghan to use Althorpe as a base could invite an overwhelming level of media attention and scrutiny. For Lewis, who has largely remained out of the public eye, the thought of his cousin using the estate to maintain his relevance might be more than he can bear. It's important to note that Harry's connection to Althorpe isn't as seamless as he might wish. Despite his emotional ties to the estate, it is well known that his mother, Princess Diana, wasn't exactly embraced there. Diana's former butler, Paul Burrell, shared letters from Charles Spencer, Diana's brother, in which he declined her request to live on the estate, citing concerns for his family's privacy and instead offering her a smaller, less secure property, hardly the support one would expect from family. Fast forward to today, and it seems history is repeating itself. Just as Charles Spencer kept Diana at a distance, Viscount Althorpe appears to be doing the same with Harry. While Harry may hope to strengthen his familial bonds with the Spencers, it is obvious that Louis Spencer isn't willing to let his cousin move in without resistance. Rumors suggest that Harry could be offered Worm Leighton, a much older Spencer property located far from the grandeur of Althorpe. However, Worm Leighton, with its lack of modern security and remote location, hardly seems appropriate for a former royal and his family. Still, it might be a fitting response from a family wishing to maintain distance from Harry. Some speculate that Charles Spencer is leveraging Harry in his ongoing feud with the British royal family as the Spencers have a long-standing rivalry with the monarchy. By aligning with Harry, Charles may aim to present himself as a caring uncle while also capitalizing on public interest in Princess Diana's legacy. Nevertheless, the likelihood of Harry being genuinely welcomed into the Spencer family or being given permanent residence at Althorpe seems highly unlikely.